Welcome to episode two of Shuffle Scuffle. We got an awesome game ahead of us, but first, I gotta shout out our amazing sponsor for this video, Dragon Shield. They have the best sleeves in the multiverse. Good sleeves. Literally just amazing. Go check out their affiliate link in the description below to get the product that we're using in this video. As always, the stipulation for this gameplay series is that you have to draw any tokens you create with infinite tokens. Hashtag not sponsored. But we got high powered decks with lots of fast mana, lots of combos this time around. If you want to check out the deck lists, go to Moxfield and follow us while you're there or buy the cards from our TCG player affiliate link. But let's get into the player introduction. Hey everyone, it's BZ. I'm playing Queen Marchessa. We're looking to mid range everybody out and basically just go for the old fashioned control strategy. My hand's got early interaction and a board wipe, so I can't do much better than this. Hey guys, Joe Cherries here. I am playing Muxus today. The main goal of this deck is just to turbo out Muxus and critical mass combo with a bunch of goblins. Kept this opening hand because it's gonna turn three Muxus. Let's see if it gets there. Hey, it's me, Rude. I'm playing Rune of the Hidden Realm, and it's basically just a flicker deck that ends with sometimes a combo featuring Ergon Drake and Dead Eye Navigator with Fencer. This opening hand looks pretty good. It's got three lands and it's got a Wood Elves on turn two thanks to Ancient Tomb, and Chulane and Mall Drifter will help stock my hand with much needed resources. Hey, this is Eric. I'm playing Marin of Clan Neltath. The deck is primarily focused on grinding out value and trying to combo kill with a Machias combo, and if all else fails, it wants to attack. This hand's pretty good. It's got some early ramp with the Finthorn Elves. It's got Demonic Tutor. It was a pretty easy keep. Welcome to the table, guys. We're going to get into our game right away. First, we've got to determine who goes first. The silly way we're going to do it today is rock, paper, scissors. But suggest the ways that you guys want us to do it in the comments. The one that gets the most likes, silliest way to do it, is how we're going to decide who goes first. Let's do it. Me versus Eric, Tim versus Beezy. Let's Felix go. Brock, rock, paper, 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 scissors, scissors shoot. Ooh. What? I was following theirs. All right, let's All do it right. again. I have taken out Eric and Wicked. But I did throw scissors. Do you think I'm going to throw it again? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my, the mind well, games are I real. couldn't even... <laughs> Throw mine down. I'm not thinking about mind games. <laughs> I'm throwing scissors. All right. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, <laughs> she said it. What are you throwing? Uh, probably scissors. All right. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. You got me. He got me. I mean, the it's that easy. You just say <laughs> what you want them to do. All right. Uh, so I guess I'm going first. BZ is going first in this game. Take it away, BZ. I'm gonna draw a card. Well, by Godless Shrine tapped and passed to Tim. I will draw. I will play. Command tower and pass the turn. Ooh. I will draw, and I'm going to play a forest and an elves and pass the turn. All right, we'll draw a card. I'm just going to start with a tapped castle Embereth and pass the turn. Very tame. Mm -hmm. Very I'll tame turn. turn one for me. Now, this card doesn't really get any better, so I'm very excited to play Path of Metal on turn two. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to deal one to each creature that doesn't have first strike what? double strike. Oh. <laughs> get that out of uh. here. I did it! Pass. Boy, am I glad I didn't go first, because I'm going to play Ancient Tomb. Ooh, followed by a 1-1. One, one. Followed by Wood Elves. <laughs> I'm going to get a forest into play and pass. Hunt it. Draw. Uh, play a Swamp. Great. And Soul Ring. Mm -hmm. And pass the turn. What did you draw for turn? On tip. Castle, he might not have drawn that for turn, he had, a, he had an elf, I think it's, that's true, that's true. to make it play an elf on turn one. That's right. true. Play Handware Battlements, tap two mana, play Mind Stone, and pass to Brad Pin. That's me. I will draw. Fun fact, the DCI, back when that existed, used to display my name as Brand Pin. <laughs> <laughs> not Brand in. Remember, remember the DCI? Yes. Uh, I'm going to play Clifftop Retreat. And apparently, I'm just the best person ever. I'm going to play Dismantling Wave, and I'm going to snipe that, oh, and I'm going to snipe that. Oh, jeez. Tim, we're best friends. This is great. The wiki, you're my mortal enemy forever. <laughs> I've done. Untap. Tim's going to run away with this game because he's just stopping everyone else. Yeah. <laughs> Here I go. Croson Verge. <laughs> Watch out for my tapped land. That was a political move. Everyone's playing Actually, it really was. I'm gonna, I forgot I had any. <laughs> I'm going to play... <laughs> Island. That was the first land you played of the turn, guys. <laughs> I'm going to take two more. Okay. And I'm going to play Mall Drifter. Ooh. And I will draw two. A modern play. And I then, don't know how that card sees modern play. I, it just blows my mind. Out of nowhere. And then two Curry Favor. I'm going to attack BZ for one. Curry Favor? Yeah. You could have Curry Favor with me, the guy who's answering everything. Look, <laughs> I'm on your guys' team. <laughs> There's no teams here. 
Yeah. Everyone I'll pass. Everyone against BZ. I got it. You're welcome for the clear board, everyone. I don't care about that. I care a little bit. <laughs> I do want my mind so back, though. I'll play it at Nurturing Peatland and pass the turn. On tip. Draw. I'm going to play a Scavenger Grounds, and then I'm going to play Zero Mana for this Dual Lotus. I'm going to crack it. To that play. time again, folks. It's that time to play Muxus. So top six cards of my library. We get all the goblins. Uh-oh. We get two gobbos. That's who we got. Okay. All right. And there's no hasty boys here, so I'll pass to BZ. All right. Feels good. It's my turn. Draw a card. Play Vault of Champions while I still have two opponents. And... So that is tap five on tap goblins? Yep. And it kind of just wipes the board? It, it wipes the board of basically everything, yes. Even okay, goblins? So, so that's yep. not relevant right now. I'm going to play Queen Marchesa, and I'm going to become the Monarch. Whoa. Now, do I want to attack is the question. Muxus is pretty scary. I think I'm going to pass and draw a card of my end step. Muxus hits pretty hard. I will untap, draw. I will... Play a Cross and Verge tapped. I will go to combat. One's open. I'm willing to take one. Just hit him for two. I'm just saying. Well, I'm trying to pretend like he's going to be I political. I am willing to just take one. I'm going to hit BZ for two. <laughs> Nowicki's wide right open. Get him. And Nowicki for one. Ooh. Take two. You're the Monarch. I am the Monarch. I will tap for five mana. Ow, ow. And I will play... Yorion, the oh, Sky oh, Nomad. So much value. And I will blink these two out until my end step. Which is now. And I will move to my end step. I will stack the Monarch first, so I'll draw. Mm -hmm. okay. Or second, right? And then these will go off. Yep. Now you have two triggers. Now how would you like to stack, stack those? Yeah. And now I would ones. like to search and then draw two. And then I will draw two off Maul Drifter. Yeah. And now I have to discard. All right. So I'm going to discard Elvish Rejuvenator and Temple of Mystery and pass to you, Noiki. Draw. Play a Maya. Forests for everyone. Right. I have three forests now. Wow. And an Oracle of Moldaya. Can right. we blind flip? Uh, Feel lucky? I have to take one to do that. Ouch. Actually, you don't because it's a forest. No, oh, it is a forest. You're right. Well, ah. You could have if you wanted to, though. Bear is not camera. To. Triskelion, that looks like a combo piece. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Play my extra land for turn and pass turn. On tip. Draw. Hmm. Alright, after the quick start, I think I'm gonna slow down a little bit here. Uh can I have the monarchy for one Tim please? How many cards do you have in your hand? You did say please put a pools. I have six. Please, please, please. This guy's gonna take it back anyway. You don't know that. He's gonna aggressively. Yes, you may. What a nice guy! I will it's one or three, right? I will just swing for one and I'll send. This is in the wiki, it's six, six. Don't want to do it. I will take one. What? You definitely want to do it. No, you were the only one I could attack. You were the only one I could attack, I swear. All right, I'll then play away for his bubble and just crack it so we can shortcut here. We'll go get a mountain. It'll be tapped. All right, so go to my end step. Monarch, I will draw for that. All right, on my upkeep. I will get an assassin, which I mean, it couldn't look any better, right? So I'll draw a card. He doesn't know is that a 1-1? One, one? His hand is open. <laughs> he's holding a butter knife the wrong way. Also, he, he doesn't even close his hand around the knife. He just has his hand like this, and the knife stuck to it. That's how good he is. <laughs> he's throwing it. Land. I'll play a forest. Does that ever get old? Probably not. Yes. All right, so cherries, I'm coming at you for one, and I have to tap a Marchesa because it's too much value. So in a wiki, I'm going to, I guess, chuck three at you so I can transform my Path of Metal into <laughs> Metzali Met Tower of Triumph. And what does that do? Uh, so it's a land, taps for any color. One and a red, tap, it deals two to each opponent. Two and a white, this is my favorite one. Choose a creature that at random that attacked this turn. Destroy. I'm going to play a new card that I've never cast before. It's Brash Taunter. Ooh, I love being a Brash Taunter. It is a goblin, so. It's also, it is in this deck. It is a goblin. Great. It's a two one. of them. All right, I'll go to head step and I'll draw a card. All right, I will untap. That was fancy. I saw that untap little movie did. Mm -hmm. Nice. Where'd you learn, did you learn that? I've been practicing. Ooh, for the cameras. Three opponents, so this will come into play untapped. <laughs> okay, nice, nice. <laughs> Alright, I will tap four for teleportation circle. Oh boy. Yikes. Lovely. So at the beginning of my end step, I can exile up to one target artifact or creature 
and then return to the battlefield under its owner's control. Then I will go to combat. I will. I'm perfectly fine taking two. Send four in the air at cherries and two in the air at BZ. That makes sense. That you are the monarch. And then I will go to my end step. Please tell me I've sorted the posh air BZ. And I'm going to exile You're Yorion. Gonna target. I'm going to target Yorion. And no, no, I really thought you might have had the swords there. I almost had them. And then Yorion coming in, I'm going to send these out until the next end step. All right. And then, did you and then I'll draw off the monitor. Your next end step or the next end step? The, the next, next end step. step. Why do you ask? Is that relevant? Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know how that card works. <laughs> Reveal. Watch out. He's got a Triskelion. No. I want to be lands so bad. Yeah, what's all the mana for? I mean, Manacraft is better than lands. It except is. Except here. But yeah, I can't play it right In now. In almost all situations, it is better than lands. So just cast Marin. Here she comes. This is such a fair game for you to have. I know. This <laughs> is awesome. Hopefully, I mean, they destroyed my BZ, own BZ stuff. Yeah, that was all BZ. Remember that. You're welcome. Remember BZ did that. You sure can. This is the nicest game. We're all friends here. Ah, oh, it is nice. Show me. <laughs> <laughs> Just think, that was all because BZ played Mark Chesson. What a nice guy. Uh, moved my hands to... Temple Garden will come in off of Wood Elves, tapped, and I will draw two off Mall Drifter. Yikes. Alright, I'll get the Infernal Elves back off Marion, and I'll draw off Anarchy. Mm -hmm. Reveal. Well, there's your land. Yep. Yeah. 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 A little bit schedule. late. A little bit late. Draw. Go ahead and play this mountain here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cast a Lightning Crafter. So I would choose to champion something as it enters the battlefield. What's so, that champion mean? So it basically, it exiles, it's like Fiend Hunter on Muxus, so he can sack his guide and then get another Muxus trigger. So yeah. if someone could kill Skirk Prospector in response, it wouldn't be the worst. I can't. It's not that big of a deal, he just gets it's, another Muxus trigger. I'm going to get another Muxus trigger eventually. I will respond. Okay. So I'm going to tap for blue, blue, two colorless. And Venser targeting the spell on the stack. Sure. Ah. So th that'll bounce this the Lightning Crafter back to my hands. Okay. I see. And then I am done with my turn, unfortunately. Go ahead. Oh, your turn. All right. I have pre rendered an assassin token. This one is even shadier and scarier. Oh, it's raining. Yeah, it's raining there. I'm going to play a Swamp Forest. I think once again, it is time for BZ to save the entire game. Uh, let's see. Let's go. Oh, yeah, because he doesn't have time. Are we killing Marin? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> first thing I thought of. Uh, let's see. Can we do it all? No. We can do it all. So we'll go white, 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 red, red, black, black, and try to destroy all permanents that are non-lands that I don't control. Oh, yeah, you're saving the game for everybody. I'm saving everyone. You're welcome. You can thank me later. I'm going to destroy all your things. I think this is completely fair, <laughs> and nobody can say boo. All right, this fair isn't enough. the most relevant. I will send three at Tim, and I will send one at the wiki to reclaim my monarchy. Ooh, monarchy. All right, and then I will pass the turn to draw a card. Go ahead. Untap. Everyone's probably wondering, how does he keep doing it? How does he control the board every turn? <laughs> He's just cast a card. Play a land. You had to answer Tim's board. No. You're going to do that again. <laughs> no, I wasn't. For free. I oh, I swear. Man, if only Tim had saved his thing so he could have more effectively used it. Huh? Define more effectively. Ah, too bad he bounced my crappy guy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's probably... I don't know if it's better or worse for you because Mux is in the command zone either way, but I guess your guys would have got wrapped away. No, I would... Mux would be back on the field right now. Oh, all right, you just save it. Yeah, I, would, I wouldn't have used it. Yeah. I'm going to tap six for Sun Titan. Oh, here we go again, folks. I'm going to get a Wood Elves. Eventually, you got to run a forest, right? Probably. So this comes into play on tapped, and we will do the classic sequencing. Okay. For Bant and two colorless for Chulane. Ah, very well sequenced. He just drew it off of his Wood Elves. <laughs> I couldn't cast it without Wood Elves, so I will move down step and pass. Oh, Tim's right back as a threat. I know the wiki's yeah, going to yeah. play Mana Crypt Ancient Tomb. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't worry about it. <laughs> no, don't worry about it. All right. I might as well not worry about it then. Yeah, there's no reason to worry about it. And you have Triskelion. Hmm. Ancient Tomb. Mana Crypt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who could have ever seen this coming? All right. Cast Mirror for six. 
Okay. <laughs> We're lost. Else. Yeah, okay. Uh, move to my end step. Target Oracle will be back to my hands. No complaints. Okay. Nice. Oh, you are? Let it be noted. I'm complaining. Draw. We're going to go ahead and cast a Goblin Recruiter. Okay. The next day. All right, I'm revealing Ringleader, Goblin Chieftain, Mog War Marshal, Matron, Goblin Churgeon, Kiki Jiki, Mirror Breaker, Impulsive Pilfer, Goblin War Chief, and Conspicuous Snoop. So we're going to go ahead and do that. It's worth noting. Conspicuous Snoop. Conspicuous Snoop goes off with Kiki Jiki. It does. It does. That's a combo. If Kiki's on top. Why is it a combo? Because oh, Conspicuous Snoop yeah, yeah. isn't legendary and just clones itself. Right, right. All right. So I'm not sure what to do about that. But it's a combo. Stack them. So you stack them in a mystery order. In a mystery, stack them now in a mystery order. I'm going to shuffle your library. And I will play Goblin King. And uh, pass to you. All right, I'll draw. <laughs> These, well, I'm going to get the monarchy! <laughs> you just what? might, folks. You, you just might, sir. Yeah, this is the worst Goblin Lord, but it is in the deck. Silent Clearing. I think we're going to have some fun. Uh, I'm a little worried about Kiki Jiki, but this card is really cool. I'm going to play... Tybalt, the Cosmic Imposter. I'm going to get an emblem. Uh, do I have to draw the emblem? I yes. Guess? Okay. And you're going to mess with the top of his deck? He is about to mess my whole top of my deck. I wasn't even thinking of that. <laughs> Dude, that's so good. All right, here's my stupid Tybalt emblem, which I'm just going to put like as close to underneath this as I can. All right, Tybalt's going to go upwards. I'm going to take the top card of everybody's deck. Yeah, I wanted to draw this one. Ah, the draw for an eternal witness, a forest, an opposition agent. That's going to be fun. All right, let's move them underneath the table, like like so. You can cast them at any time. So you can yep. Flash and head I can just kind of play them whenever. Yep. We don't have mana for it. Right. I can't. Right. I do have to spend mana. Yeah. I feel like I just became somewhat of an enemy, so I probably shouldn't attack. I'm going to pass and draw. Okay. I will untap. You're lucky that two lanes didn't play. I mean, no one could do anything about it. You were supposed to have a field day, I'm sure. You're the one who played Tipple. You could have killed it. Might be the first time two lanes ever Must resolved. All right. I will play a Yavamaya Coast. Cool. I'm going to then play Timeless Witness. Trigger. I will draw a card and put a land from my hand onto the battlefield if I want. Okay. Probably should, probably should minus. <laughs> you know. I feel like he would have just died. It's tough. You know, it's tough. I could, I could see the, the appeal. I'm going to get Teleportation Circle back to my hand. Okay. I will then play said Teleportation Portal. Was it a circle or a portal? Make up your mind. Circle. I'm going to fetch. I will then tap three mana for Reflector Mage. Oh, boy. And two lane will trigger. I will draw a card and put a land into play. Nice. All right. I'm going to bounce Brash Taunter. Don't like it, but I accept it. And you will not be able to play that. Don't expect a Brash next Taunter turn. next turn, audience. And then I'm going to go to combat. And I'm going to attack with Sun Titan at Cherries. Uh, me? You What's heard. That you just stacked your deck. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't worry about that too much. I was kind of shut down. Right, you truly us off first. Yeah. I will get Elvis Rejuvenator. Do you have enough lands? That's all. I can choose between lands I'm or a creature. In general. Five. I bet your deck doesn't even have Field of the Dead in it. What a waste. All right. I will move to my end step. Teleportation Circle will trigger. Yeah. I'm going to use my Teleportation Circle trigger to flicker Timeless Witness. Okay. And as it comes back in, I will target Yorion to return to my hand. Yeah, you can never get enough. You're a value fiend. How many cards do you have? No pass. I have five cards. Five, okay. I mean, I guess that's... Oh, we have these sweet coins? That's what we can use to flip. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, so I'm always going to call heads. Is that the dragon side? Yeah. Heads. That's uh, got to be the tails. Right. Thanks, is, Dragon Shield. Yeah, this is, this is definitely tails. Yeah. Dragon Shield sponsors this three damage dealt on the wiki. Mm -hmm. You know, it's my uh, I'm gonna bury alive. Oh boy! Yeah. 
Okay. <clears throat> All right, so I'm gonna Buried Alive for Visser Seer, uh, Machias, and Protean Hall. Not bad uh, uh, Buried's. I don't know what to call them. <laughs> Not bad Buried's. <laughs> Sounds uh, like it's calling you Buried's. I'm going to Demonic Tutor. A D Tutor. This opposition agent is looking so bad. <laughs> Do you think? Good. All right. All right. Then I'm going to take three, I guess, to cast Victimize. Oh. Interesting. Yeah. Choose. Well, if, yeah, if it was. Because if it, it happens all at the same time, right? Yeah. I'm going to choose Mr. Seer and Makai's in my graveyard. So you guys think you're going to remove both of this creature so Victimize doesn't work? That's the plan. That doesn't sound that bad. I have nothing else besides that. Okay, so you do have something. I have something. All right, all right. I'll respond. I'll respond. I'm going to cast a Swords to Plowshares. I'm going to target the Findhorn Elves. Oh, whatever. Okay. Yeah. A little bit green in response. All right, you gain a life. I will fetch. This was the bait, guys. He's about to show you some. <laughs> yeah, this, this was the, all the This trick. was the bait. Wow, I only have that as a target. All right. I will play a Hollow Fountain. Shock. And I will tap blue and a green. Okay. Oh, I was just checking. I was getting ready. <laughs> For Cyclonic Rift targeting oh, Marin. I see. So, this goes back to my hand. Yeah. <laughs> you did have a bounce. I told you. <laughs> I, I literally told you. Well, we're not perfect. All right. So this does nothing now. Yeah, so Victimize still has targets, but there's nothing to sacrifice, so it won't work. <laughs> Can't argue with that. All right. That was um, danger. That was the danger. I guess I end my turn. Somebody put a loyalty counter on Tibble. <laughs> Shields down. Exile all graveyards. <laughs> on tip. Wiki is my mortal enemy. Draw. Alright, the first thing we'll start with this, which is Okay. I'm gonna give sure, some dude. That some already guys. kills the Tibble. No, this is five. This, so this is, that guy doesn't have Mount Lock. So it's all goblins. Yeah, it's yeah, a lot to others. It's oh, all it's yeah. Joe got the incorrect version. I will then cast a Dockside Extortionist. Oof. For a second, I was like, oof, and I don't have anything. I did, there's only two. One. Yes, yeah, so one and one. Two. two. So we get two treasures, which I have to draw. Two treasures. Pretty tame Dockside Extortion. Yeah, getting only two treasures, but I think we're going to. You said you were just passing? I think we're going to use the two treasures here. I swords Nowicki's creature for you. I wasted Psychrift. Yeah, for you. I just so that, and now Tibble must Just die. so that you Yeah, have <laughs> now I think we have enough to kill Tibble here. This is three. Eight. Eight. This is enough. Looks to, like someone doesn't want the monarchy. <laughs> yeah, I do want the monarchy, but unfortunately I have to settle for not getting the monarchy. Nobody uh, even wants to mention that. All right, so we'll kill Tibble. All right, so just eight of Tibble? No, we'll do we're, we'll do five of Tibble. So you're not killing Tibble? Not technically killing Tibble yet. Technically? Okay, so what's happening? You're swinging five at me, five Tibble, and three at me? Yes. One, two, three. No, two. Two at you. Three at me. Gotcha. Three at you, yes. <laughs> I will take three. You become the monarch, and Tibble takes five, down to two. Or he, yes, he takes, well, I know he takes six. Oh, he takes six. He takes six, yes. And then we'll cast. It's eroded. We'll use this treasures to cast this battle him. So you make four mana, four red mana? Yep, and then we'll cast this lightning crafter. Okay. It'll enter. So it has haste. It has haste, and I will champion the goblin recruiter. I see where this is going. You're going to ping him. I will shoot Tibble off. All right, he's done. And. We get to keep the emblem. And it doesn't I, go away. And I get the monarchy. That's a, That was the whole key of that whole play. I will draw a goblin. Probably. So can you explain to the viewers what championing does? Uh, championing for the viewers. Just for the viewers. Uh, yeah, I know the viewers don't know. Champion is essentially, when it, as it enters the battlefield, you have to choose a creature of the type. This is goblin or shaman. I choose this goblin. So it exiles it until this leaves the battlefield. And then when this leaves the battlefield, this returns to play. On my upkeep, when I start my turn, I will receive a third assassin. You can tell my effort is decreasing. I will draw a card. Jeez, his arms are long. They really are. Like if he, like, if he stretched them out, they'd be touching the ground. It'd be really gross. Got one really long one though. <laughs> this, this part went even longer. I thought I didn't have a land for turn, but this Tybalt emblem, which was so well drawn, my land gives me Tim's land, my land. Oh. Uh, count your opponents real quick. Count my opponents. It's a tri land. Really? Or like only in my head? Because in my head, I basically only have one opponent. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. I'm just kidding. That's a um, slate against you two. Just messing around. I mean, maybe. Maybe it's like it's you. I'm just messing around. 
have decided my play. Cherries has so graciously offered the monarchy for one. I will sort of take your offer. I'm going to attack you for five. <laughs> what? And I'm going to attack the wiki for one. Why don't you send the rest in the wiki? Sorry. You're helped out the most by this play. Once again, Beezy's doing his best to keep the world a better place. I'm going to try to vanquish the horde. The wiki just doesn't hurt you. No, it does not. It helps you. No. Oh, I am the monarch, though. It helps me a little bit. Oh, a little. <laughs> Yeah, everything is going to die. But because of Champion, we're going to get the Goblin Recruiter back so we can restack this damn deck. One hour later. Ugh. Wait, so what's happening? He's not revealing He's any. Searching I'm not searching for any goblins because I should have played better and put Dockside underneath my Lightning Crafter, but I okay. did not. All right, so then I guess I take back what I said about that helping you. I will play Eternal Witness. Just try to insulate us against some more shenanigans. I'm going to... I think I'm gonna grab source of shares. That seems like the, the right call. So we're gonna do that, and just thinking about like, it would be really funny and probably actually pretty good to get back Valky because it takes Triskelion out of Nowicki's hand. Plus, I'm sure you guys have creatures. No. Oh, you don't? Well, maybe that's bad though. Nah, I'm just gonna go ahead and pass turn, and I will draw. Okay. I will untap. But also, at this card. Wow. What a roller coaster. Your well, I'll be untapping my lands for a while, so don't worry. How many lands do you have? Three. I'm going to discard a Savine's Reclamation. Okay, untap, upkeep, a draw. I'll say it once and then never again. I have an opposition agent and I will use it. I'm going to play Woodfall Primus. Oh boy. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. I'm going to destroy. Is it gonna be Metzali? Yeah, it's gotta be. What? It's gotta be? It's gotta be. <laughs> it's gotta be. You, you were complaining about that mana crypt, sir. But. I was too afraid of it. Man, that is like. <sighs> I have a teleportation circle for mana crypt. That's a huge bummer. Spoilers. Is that what you're actually using? <laughs> yeah. Really? You're gonna hit my mana crypt? Dude! It's like or your ancient other, tomb. No, no you're, you're, you're mana crypt, for sure. Alright, I'm just trying to think of how I cast a spell first, like this opposition agent. Yeah, I will cast opposition agent, and then it will get destroyed. The glory of Mitsali is gone. Oh, I guess I could get it back with <laughs> Sabine's Reclamation. It's true. I'm is going to tap five for Rune. Hey, there he is. Hey, I didn't even know you could cast him. The, the final commander. I will move to my end step, trigger right. a teleportation circle on Woodfall Primus, and I will target Mana Crypt. I go. Yep. I wouldn't say that. They will name this trial master you, Jim. <laughs> Just call it Rune's House. That's the name Rune's of the trial. Rune's House Party. Uh oh. I mean, I cast Marin. All right, she's back. Is that paying two life? Yeah, two life. Can you imagine if that was exiled and not bounced to his hand? Brutal. <laughs> he would be at two more life. He wouldn't even be able to cast Marin. It costs eight. No. Let's not worry about that. All right, I'm not too worried about it. That's a good one. Ooh. And I'll move to my end step. Uh, target the source of your mirror. Makes sense to me. He is back. Yes, Untap. Draw. The, uh, I got nothing. Cherries is a new man. <sighs> I'll play a brash taunter. <laughs> Go ahead. And see. You still got one to deal with, buddy. Oh, I, I have trampled now, so I'm not worried about it. New developments. And you still have one in your hand, right? Yeah, so, I do. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yep. Here's proof. All right. New I developments have arisen, and I definitely need to take one damage and source the plow shares. This. What? Yeah. What do you mean? I what? Give me your stupid <laughs> six. <laughs> play okay. back. Yeah. Check tapes. Drucker. Ooh. All right, well, this probably frees up this play. I'm going to play my own Mana Crypt. And we're going to go two, four, six, and use this as a forest for eight. And I have not resolved this card either, and I'm excited. It is Fevered Suspicion. So I'm going to look at your top card, or you exile cards until you hit some, a permanent that's not land, and I get to cast it for free. Yes. For free? Yeah, but it's free. not me, and it has rebound. <sighs> Embercleave. Embercleave? <gasps> Cloud Blazer? <laughs> Okay, yeah. well, let's dive off. Okay. Or dive off. There you go. So, so there's crazy. a lot of things. Uh, wow. So I guess we'll go this one first. Then we'll cast Cloud Blazer. And then we're casting a Diabolic Intent. All right. So as additional cost, we'll sack this Eternal Witness. Here you go. I will tutor. Moments later. I have found a card. And I haven't made my land drop, so I guess I will. <laughs> the Jukabog Wiki. Did, did you resolve all these? Nope. 
Guess I'll draw two and gain two. And I equip this to a composition agent and then do that. <laughs> oh, what did I hit? I wasn't really paying attention. Did I get any of the big boys? Yeah. Case is in here, right? Yeah. Alright, I can rest a little bit easy. Oh. Mikey is out of here. So I randomly have a 4 3 double strike, I guess? What? Well, Tim's. I'm not going to attack Mikey. I feel like I already, I just did that. I just had to even it out. I just attacked you. You just killed me. I did a bad thing. <laughs> yeah. This gets through Brash Toronto in a way that most cards don't. But Tim Rood's probably the next best board state. So I think I'm going to attack Tim for eight. Well, I still can. Okay. Oh, that was hard. Uh, all right. I'm still the Monarch. Nothing has changed. I do gain two life off Cloud Blazer. Probably should resolve that. And I will play Thematic Compass with my remaining mana and go to my end step. This will transform. Wow. What does that one do? Uh, it is now a Maze of Ith for <sighs> creatures I don't control. And I will draw cards on the Monarch. Uh, I have seven cards, so I am done, Tim. Okay, untap. Draw. I absolutely can. Of course uh, I can. What are you, crazy? I was just wondering. I will play my land for turn. A forest. Nice. Resolves. I will... What land is that? Forest. Windswept Teeth? Oh, okay. I just don't know that art. I will eternalize. Do I make a token for this? You gotta make a token, sir. Okay, yeah. couldn't fit at all, but... Show us what you did. Show the class your work. There's my 4-4 Eternal Witness. Timeless Witness, should I say. She looks really... Uh... She's sitting on a rock. It's just... Oh. Almost, it's pretty close to uh, the okay. art. Yeah. So, Cyclonic Rift, back to my hand. You got yeah. it. Oh, and now you can flicker the Timeless Witness and end stuff. I'm going to move to combat. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to attack Beezy with Rune. Well, why? Before blockers. I'm going like to... like to tap my land? I'm going to blink Cloud Blazer. Okay, if we want to do things in response for no reason, before blocks, I'll untap it. Oh, wait. No. No! Oh, what have I done? I don't even know what I did, but... This is oh, great. I broke Beezy. Yeah. I feel like... Yeah, you give him her activation. Well, there was nothing I could have done, right? Because it's no, talking no. with Vigilance. Yeah, there was yeah. nothing you could have ever done here. All right, so that's a little stinky. That makes me the arch enemy? Yeah, I do have an effect, though. I am going to pay for life, and I'm going to try to snuff him out. You poked the beast. Cyclonic like Rift. You broke my brain. Do it now. Do it, yeah, now is <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> Legacy All-Star. Yes, it really is. Okay. Also a Commander All-Star. He is dead, and he will now cost... It's pretty funny that I took four anyway. Two more? I got this. All right, I'm going to tap my seven mana. Yeah. Do you lose two? Yes. I'm going to play Palancron. I'm going to untap seven mana. I'm going to play Rune. Okay. Okay. No, I don't take two for that. I'm going to... Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. Like, let sorry. Me I'm sorry. Right. I'm going to move to end step, and I'm going to target Palancron okay. with... This oh. to untap seven lands. God, what is going on? And you get a cloud blazer. And this will come back in. I will gain two and draw two. Cool, cool, cool. It's Pass turn. Real cool. At least Rune is summoning sick. We, we, we have that going for us. And he's still holding up the clock rift. Yeah. Yeah. It certainly feels like I can never win this game. <laughs> I'll play an Oracle of Mobile. Never too late to ramp. It's good to get that going. <laughs> Save that. Good to develop the board. <laughs> I'm gonna sacrifice like Viscerous Seer to mm -hmm. itself to scry one, and then I'll lose a life and draw one. And okay, yeah, you could just get that right now. Reveal draw this scry. And scry. Uh, New tap goes. Hey! It's a With a zombie incoming! And yeah, I'll get one zombie. There's my, my zombie on the field of the dead. Uh, okay, I didn't reveal the land off the top, so I am... Wait, who's the monarch? It's me. Easy. Easy. monarchy for a couple damage. Three damage, though? I feel like we're better off trying to attack cherries and deal some damage to them. I mean, I'll do that. Well, but I... He's got, he can block with his indestructible. Right, but then we can throw it at Tim. Beezy has yeah, a... I mean, I'll do that, too. Beezy has a I'm full like mitt. All right, so Beezy has a full mitt. Three at Beezy and three at cherries. You are both threats. Uh, I will block, but I don't know who I'm going to that. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. I'm taking three. You want to act like it's like, oh yeah, because it's my fault that you're also at 28 oh, life with a full right. net. Yeah, damage all happens at the same time, so damage happens. So now happens. you have to target somebody. Trigger on the stack. You're I gonna be the will monk. target. You don't know what he's the monitor. That, that doesn't work like that. <laughs> Unfortunately for me. 
Now I gotta hit you, BC. This yeah. is great. <laughs> you're both threats. Right. I think you're uh, a bigger threat than me. Then I'll, I'm sure. <laughs> move to my end step. I'll draw off the monarchy and I'll get back Mr. C. Rook Marin. Yep. And two. Don't even act like that Spires of Araska is not doing stuff. Draw. It's not doing anything apparently. <laughs> mana Vault. So you have Mana Vaults. Tap Mana Vaults and two lands. Cast this Vanquisher's Banner. Okay. Naming. Naming. Uh, we'll name Goblins. Okay. If you guys Gotta lose. keep them honest. And I will cast a Mogwar Marshal Trigger to draw a card. Draw a card. Things are happening. There's a goblin for everybody. That's pretty cute. That's pretty cute. <laughs> he's got. He's if only I knew what it was. Doesn't say what it is. Is that, a, is that a squid? His name is Geoblin. That reminds me of the one Adam West Batman movie where Penguin like calls the the office and he he says he's P N Gwyn. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like the guy doesn't know and Batman's like P N Gwyn. The Penguin. <laughs> Good idea, Batman. That's probably what it is, Batman. I, don't know. I, I play Ancient Tomb in my. Well, you're talking about the penguin. <laughs> I mean, they literally do that with uh, the Riddler, too. His name was Enigma. Enigma. It's the same <laughs> thing. Yeah, the real name just is Enigma. Uh, go ahead, PC. All right, so on upkeep, I get to flip a magical dragon shield coin. I'll call heads. Look, it's heads. Wow, look, room's dented now. <laughs> yeah, I don't like I damage this. damage magic card. All right, and also on upkeep, I'm going to rebound fevered suspicion. So if anyone has any responses, let me know. You're gonna hit a trash can. That has real. What, what happens to the ones that don't uh, don't get uh, taken? They just like, exile. They actually just stay exiled. They're exiled. Yeah. Oh my god, it's cradle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna stick it. Give me, give me your best things, please. Yeah, or, uh, yeah, yeah. I was thinking about this first thing. Yeah. Button. Oh boy, do I really? <laughs> Remember, I was goblin. This is so awkward because we're on my upkeep. You have five mana to use at instant speed. I know, it's, I'm going to cast them all. It's just like... What is the the, the blue card there? Peregrine it's Drake. It's Peregrine Drake. So I'm going to... I can do something. I'm going to float... We'll, we'll float four mana and still my upkeep with these cards in the stack. Well, let's say these resolve. This one on the stack. We'll float four. We're going to go Hagrid Mulling on Palacrop. All right, I'm going to attempt to return it to my hand. With what? Oh, what? with its own ability? Yeah, you could probably do that. <laughs> okay, so then... We're gonna untap five lands. I don't think I can do anything with a floating mana, so I won't do that. Mm -hmm. I will go for it. All right, I think I figured out what I'm gonna do. I am going to, oh, this is a plains basically. So I will pay a white and full colorless to play Blind Obedience. Creatures and stuff are entering tap. I will use my remaining colorless floating to cast and extort a Dockside Extortionist. I have two. So we'll resolve the trigger. I have zero. I have one. All right, so I will make Three. Three treasures, folks. Here they are. Treasures that may or may not be used to extort further. Oh, man. It's a real issue that Tim just still has that thing going on. What thing? Wait, the just Cyclonic the whole, Rift? the whole deck. Basically. Yeah, the whole deck. <laughs> you turn. Like everything you've got is a threat. That's a big issue. I'm sorry. No, you're not. I'm not. Oh. <laughs> you really fooled me. <laughs> you guys were. We were so Sadly mistaken. duped by that. All right, Tim. There's a fresh eight coming at you. Uh, I'll block. All right. Does it have trample? It does have trample. It's got double strike too, so it yeah. won't kill it. I'm not planning on killing it. All right, I'm going to block with Timeless Witness and take four. Right. I'll pay three for a Sword of the Animist, and I will extort it. Would you like to sack your Goblin Trash Master to destroy Sword of the Animist? No, uh, I'm definitely going to sack these Goblins at some point. I'm glad I drew the only other Goblin I have in my deck. Pass turn. Untap. Upkeep a draw. I will play the white side of this pathway because the other side's green and there's a Yavamaya Cradle of Growth on the field. How about that? It's a lot of mana you left open there. Thank you. Appreciate it. Someone's got to. Someone's got to work on you. You can exile my graveyard. Mm -hmm. All graveyards, even. You think so, huh? I'm going to tap seven mana. I don't know what this could be. And play Palancron. Okay. So should I kill Rune in response? Does that help us? I don't think so. I don't know. It doesn't. I don't think so. You killed Tim Rude in response? No. Um, he's actually at too much life 
So the thing that I'm thinking was that if he were at less life, we would have a much better shot. He would be at nine. But unfortunately, that is so much closer to zero when I haven't played what we need to play. All right, anyway, it's fine. Okay, I will untap the lands that he cost. I will then play Thassa. Okay. Okay, just so I know, if I target this twice with both of these, only one happens. Right. All right, who's the uh, monarch? Don't worry about it. And that thing is there, which is silliness. I'm going to go to attacks. Gotcha. And I'm going to send a 2-2 Cloud Blazer in the air at Nawiki. I'll allow it. I won't spider wow. sit. I really didn't. I thought you oh, might. I thought you might. I think I might need the mana. And I will go to my end step and I will have two triggers. I will target Cloud Blazer with Teleportation Circle and Palancron with Thassa. Okay. Just do something. Tap out. <laughs> you jerk. And they will come into play tapped, but yep. I will gain two and I will draw two and I will untap these lands. <laughs> you have to target any of my lands. Yeah, so then you could fight your Palancron. Mm -hmm. No, I'm going to target Spire of Rask. No, Don't tap? I'm not okay. <laughs> All right. And I draw for the monarch. Sorry. Uh, Angel for the monarch? You don't sound sorry. <laughs> you guys know my sarcasm. Play this Agadine tapped and get another zombie. The zombie's looking that way. I like <laughs> how they all, all of our drawings have spike limbs. And hats. <laughs> and hats. And hats. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna sacrifice this Viscera Seer to itself. Alright, so you lose one, draw a card. Draw my only card. Can I get the monarchy back for two? Are you gonna deal with that blind obedience? Uh, maybe. Because you know it's gonna kill us. I, I, mean, uh, I, I just drew a cost of Caterpillar. I know, I need, for Tim Rude I need to know right if you're now. going to. Well, unfortunately, it, it's, not, it's not discriminant. So it just goes for whoever. Yeah, I need to know that that's okay, going to be on. Sure, I'll, I'll cost it. Oh. Okay, it's on recording, and I will take two the for the monarchy. Okay. All right, guys, get them. I could have screwed up that deal, but you know, I think he might now then spite me with it. So cast the cost of caterpillar. You don't want to do this, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's playing you. He has to. It's binding. Oh, pull up. The line Alright, well I will respond. Yeah. And I think Cherries might like this. Maybe. Last time you said that, Maybe he not. did not like yeah, that. Last, yeah, last time, uh, yeah. I'll sacrifice a treasure. I'm going to play Crackling Doom and pay the extort. So I will respond and I will tap two mana to exile Clawblazer. Okay. And Thassa will turn off. She will be turned off. So it resolve? And now it will resolve, yep. Alright, so let's resolve extort. And then you guys all take two, and you sack your biggest things. Sack my one one. So I'll sacrifice my Night Reaper. This guy once said that um, his dad died. So this is actually going to right. put five. So now you're going to draw two more. and lose two, right? I'm going to draw two lose two. Do not. Let me see what I draw. Which are? Corpse Logger and Jeep Master. All right. And I reveal the top card. It's still not a land. Very sad. <clears throat> How many creatures does everybody have in the graveyard? In my graveyard? Yes. One, two, three, four. Out loud counting. Five, six, seven. I have one, and it's Valky. I have seven. I have eight. Why do you ask? Yeah, I'm gonna cast this corpse auger. Oh, all right. Then I'll move to my end step and target my viscera seer in my graveyard with Marin. And you draw a card. Yep. And I draw a card. Cloud Blazer will come back in, tap. These are all. Ta oh, Blindo's gone. Blindo's Ooh, gone. You're free. Untapped. We'll gain two. And, I have to move and I'll draw two. Um, because I have too many cards in my hands. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and draw. Take a damage. Yep, I do have that silly card. I'm going to start with a Velcro Awakening. I'm going to choose to put this one card from my hand onto the bottom. Good old tormenting voice. And I'm going to draw two. Well, that's true. He's got a lot of life. I'm going to cast a Goblin Churgeon in draw card. So I'll play this land that I drew off the Churgeon. Makes sense. And then I'll pass. All right. I have another Mana Crypt trigger. Get ready, Rue. All right. It is Tails. I have so much trouble reading that, so I lose three. And I will draw a card, which I hope is good, honestly. All right, Cherry. So are we trying to force him to Rift? I mean, definitely. Okay. Well, definitely. That's, that's pretty sick. I want to see if there's anything I want to do pre-combat. I guess I will equip... My sword to my agent. 
and then I will attempt to go to Sith Combat. I will respond. Oh, will you? I'm How going to that? use Thassa's ability to tap Opposition Agent. That makes sense. I don't like it, but it makes sense. I'm also going to tap the Trash Master. The Trash Man comes in and he throws garbage all over his head. Yeah, I think I'm just going to attack you for four, too. Okay, no blocks. Damage. Flash in a second Ember Cleave. <laughs> you can't really rift in response to this, so I will play a Liliana. Dreadhorde General. Oh, Jesus. All right, I'm going to minus four. Make everybody sacrifice two creatures. Mark That'll resolve. Uh, All right. Probably, unless Noiki's doing something cool. I'm just trying to figure out if I can afford to sacrifice this Corpse Augur. I don't think I can. All right, so sac Drake and Dockside, I will draw two from her static. I will cast Perforos, God of the Forge. That's a way to deal some damage. Yeah, please. That's a way to deal some damage. <laughs> both of our left totals. <laughs> <laughs> How chaotic are you feeling? Today? I will spend some treasures. Mm -hmm. I was thinking that was the other land, but you guys blew up my fancy land. No, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to cast Ophiomancer. All right, mm -hmm. I'm going to deal two to each opponent. And that is my turn. Okay, I'm going to untap. All right, there is an upkeep trigger on Ophiomancer to make a snack. It will resolve. We're gonna be living dangerous here in the wiki. I I feel like I'm wild card in this There's one. There's ETB, and we're gonna trigger it. Yep. I will draw. Proceed, sir. All right, I'm gonna play Fairy Time Raveler. Yep. I don't think if anyone wants to read it, you know, the text is right here. Yeah. I'm gonna bounce Perforos. I'll draw. Boo! I say boo. Terrasty, nasty. Can I have that Perforos back? I want some elephants. It can hit, what, non-creature stuff? Yeah, it beasts within three things, but they're not creatures. So, Embercleave, okay. Sword, Liliana. All right. Embercleave, Sword, so these three? Yep. Okay, so I guess I'll respond. I mean, I just don't think this Trash Master is doing anything, so. Um, I will throw it at Cherry's Threat Assessment, oh, comma, Joe, oh, to draw a card. Oh, I, get, I get to draw a card out of it. I don't care. Uh, I didn't draw a counter spell, so these three are going to get nuked into beasts. <laughs> I, I, honestly, I think we did good. Beast number one, Joe Cherries. Beast number two, me and Tim. That's amazing. I don't know. Phenomenal. That's going out in, in the Hall of Fame for Terrasino tokens. I'm going to move to end step. I think I know where this is going. I'll target Terrasidon both times with the triggers. Let's go. And it only comes back once. Right? Yeah, it only comes back once, but I... Let the record show. Let's target twice. I will target... Listen, if you don't target Field of the Dead, I'll get rid of the, the Taunter next turn. Okay. What? That Noted. Doesn't do, don't do that. All right. I want to... We can use this against Beezy. Oh, You he guys can, can answer it, but I can deal nine to Beezy. The spiel. Okay. Spires, Scavenging Grounds, Mana Crypt. All right. I lose some more things. Oh, you guys are jerks. I don't know if you us? understand. Plural? Like, <laughs> all of us are jerks? Tim did that alone. I will pass the turn. Alright, untap. Draw the turn. I am going to play the Troop of Bog. Makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Um, I think I'd have to hit BZ. I don't know. Alright, so we're gonna, we're gonna Bog. Yeah. We can, we can can't say I'm mad. I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. That seems like a, a reasonable play. I can't believe you my lane. Then, Tim, I'm going to come at Barry with these two. Okay, okay, okay. Didn't see this coming. I will block Marin. Okay. Fairy will die. R.I.P. I, <laughs> I want to play one more lands, get one more zombie. So. And then I'm going to meat hook massacre. All right, hold on. We can figure this out. <laughs> you can sacrifice can, I can sac out. I can sacrifice creatures. We can figure this out. I can sacrifice creatures so you don't die, Tim. <laughs> I need to be at, like... Yeah, you need to sack all your creatures, to be honest. To be honest. They're all going to die anyways. I know, but... Well, I'm going to sack this one first. And I'm going to... I mean, yeah, I'm going to lose zero. Thank you. Yeah, good um, call. You scry one. You scry one. Cry one. Scry one. Scry one. Even there, yeah. <laughs> the oracle goes, 
You threw him too far. No, no. no. <laughs> Go back. <laughs> All right. Are you happy, Tim? Thank you. This is for you. <laughs> All right. So now there's a meetup for what, six? Yeah. I'm not going to respond. I'll target Teresa now. You lose two? Lose two. All right. I mean, oh, no, I won't lose two because I can tap this. I was hoping you wouldn't. All right. So I'll activate and I'll target Teresa now. All right. Damage, right? You have to throw down nine. Yep. You know, if you target Wiki, the ability doesn't resolve. He's, he's got a million three threes. I just want you to know that <laughs> that's what happens. Like, we can't. According to the rules of magic. I mean, you could not. Tim's got the resolve. rift. You could let it not target resolve, you, but, yeah, I think it's. I think it'd be wrong. Coward. <laughs> Coward. Right, so how many creatures dying? Yeah, that's rolling. No, I'm sacking mine in response to the meetup master. No, come on. That's <laughs> the one. Well, he's not going to actively kill you, but he won't save you. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, so the beast does die, because I do, cannot sacrifice it. Here's this. Oh, my pretty tokens, gone. Alright, uh, I guess I'm going to move to my end step and draw from the monarchy. And the tides have shifted, though, right? Take one. Uh, I don't know. I'm just trying to be everybody's friend, guys. The tides have <laughs> definitely play a conspicuous I, snoop. I didn't kill Tim. Conspicuous. Conspicuous I, snoop. I'm gonna yeah, give I think... A, uh, watch this. I'm going to give a haste. Uh, and I hate hitting the wiki for two to get the monarchy. Oh, that's, that's pretty reasonable, relevant. Reasonable. All right, go to my answer. Draw this card. Well, well you don't move. All right, no more mana crypts oh, or anything. Yeah, I will just draw. Sure. That's <laughs> something... There's nothing crazy going on, so I think it makes sense to play Perforos, and I will play a Forest, and I will tap my Forest for a Marchessa. How's that? Psychrims. <laughs> <laughs> Single target Psychrims. Yeah. The game too. It really is. That's what it is. It's devastating. Yeah, I'm going to respond. All right, is this an overload? Uh, I mean, we, it is a ritual. It lets, it lets him cast boxes. Yeah. It would let Cherry's cast Muxus. Oh, yeah, okay, I guess that's fair. Yeah, so I'll okay. just target. Perforos goes back. I will be the monarch. There you go. Are you going to combat? Because I'm tapping it. Oh, with Thassa? Well, I guess it doesn't well, matter then. Right. Oh, well, in my turn to draw a card. So now I know you were going to attack me. Me? <laughs> All the information is <laughs> yeah, on there. I just said I hate right? everybody. <laughs> that doesn't mean anything about you. I take that personally. <laughs> oh, sure. <laughs> Man, I don't have any friends. You mean that you have one enemy. All right, I'm going to draw. Do it. All right, so I'm gonna play Lightning Greaves. Ooh, it could not be good. No. Don't worry about it. We're all tapped out. We're gonna work about it. I need to gain life here. All right, I'm gonna tap Greaves. these three for Aura Shards. Ooh. I'm gonna play Phyrexian Metamorph. Mm -hmm. Copying Lightning Greaves. Copying Queen Marchessa. Okay, you are in fact the Monarch. Aura Shards trigger is gonna be on Meat with Massacre. Dead eye. Okay. Soul bonding with Phyrexian Metamorph slash Queen Marchessa. All right. He's always the monarch. And I will equip to Dead Eye. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go to my end step. Trigger. I'll just. I will blink this. Same things. Copying Queen Marchessa. And I will the draw monarch. off yeah. the monarch. You just saved me one life. Uh, during your end step. You're welcome. I'm going to cast an Entomb, I guess. Yeah. I don't know what for, but... I remember that from a while ago. I remember thinking, yeah, if I position change it. Uh, I will Entomb of Ender of Zendikar and untap. I'm going to animate bed. All right. You're making moves. But you wish you had this Perforos. <laughs> Targeting. Of Ender of Zendikar. Alright, ten plants. Ten plants. Oh, those are cute. No, I think just put y'all out here. Whoa. Oh, no. I don't have enough life to do anything real with the it. The proliferate guys. is already good enough. I think I'm <laughs> done after that. Yeah. On tip. Draw. Reveal. Cool. You are spatting a thousand with those uh, reveals. I'm just going to go ahead and play all my mana. Whoa. Cast this Muxus for the second time. It's really like the top five cards because you know one's a brick. Two bricks. Three bricks. Not a brick. That is not good. That is. Oh boy. That is. Oh boy. Oh. I don't even think it does anything. 
That's an extra Muxus. Oh, no, it's not. That's okay, never mind. Two of, the, two of your hits were legendary. Yep. Oh, and you get a Goblin. They don't have haste. Oh, we'll get a 1-1 one, one Goblin. No, only Kiki, only Kiki has haste. Yeah. I was thinking the wrong card for a second. What's your top card, though? Matt? Top card is Matt? Thought Vessel. Very strong. How are we going to tame this board state? Best. We're not. My turn. Figure it out, BZ. Well, I will get an assassin. You do have a million cards in hand. I have so. a couple. They're not great, but I will get an assassin and I will draw. Oh, All right. I will play a Felidar Retreat. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Then I will play a Strip Mine and I'll try to make a cat. All right. There's going to be a Perforous Trigger. Ba boo, ba boo, ba boo. I'll go to combat. <clears throat> I don't even remember how I lost the monarchy. Yeah, you're a combat. Pass. Exactly. I said pass. There's no way I can get anything. Yeah, I'm going to blink Phyrexian Metamorph. All right. Yeah. So he will blink. War Shards target here. I'm going to have him copy. Yeah, I'll if try. You, but I'll, if you do Avenger, I can just sack it. Well, you can't. Well, you, you have to respond it. to the flicker. Oh, I would have to respond to the flicker that doesn't target? No, no clones don't target. Oh, okay. All right, Tim. When you flicker, what are you thinking about doing? <laughs> <laughs> Probably doing Avengers Undercar. But then I have to sack it. Probably. So lame. Tim gets to bully you into sacking it for nothing. I mean, I get to, I get to put a minus one minus one counter on something. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll sack this. Uh, I put a counter on your assassin. So with the Yawgmoth. So yeah, it was like an eye drop card. Goodbye, assassin in the rain. All right, so it'll come in and enter as. What do you got over there? That's cool. Anything? I'll copy Kiki. Okay. Seems cool. Are there any more artifacts or enchantments? No. Well, there's this. You're gonna, so you're gonna blow this oh, one. yeah, I targeted that with the Warshards. So yeah. It was animated, but it's gone. Yeah, okay. On to that. <laughs> okay. It's so weird that I couldn't take the Monarchy. I haven't had the Monarchy in a very long time. Easy, 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 easy. Well, I, got, I became the Monarch, but like I haven't had it very much this morning. Why is that, how is that a cat? It's a silhouette of a cat. Yeah, I see it. I mean, it's painfully odd. That's a really it good cat. It looks like Dragon Air or something. It's a really good cat, and it's not whatever you just said. I'm going to play Eternal Witness for three mana, and I'm going to target Peregrine Drake to come back. Sounds good. Now I'm going to cast Peregrine Drake. I think we're, we might still be okay. I'm going to untap these five. Mm -hmm. Might be okay. Yeah, we might still be. I don't know if he can go in for that. Maybe if he's not paying attention, he can't. I don't think he can. I can. Unless you have responses, obviously, which you have hey, to. Feel free to go for it. I'm going to go for it. <laughs> I'm going to blink Phyrexian Metamorph, so I'll have it come back in. I'm going to copy Eternal Witness. Yeah, these are going to be Soulbound. I'm going to target Fencer. So I think you might want to respond to this trigger, the Soulbound trigger. Who might? Yawgmoth guy over there. He's got 10 uh, negative counters to throw around. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, I'm going to sack two of these to put a counter on this and this. Fencer's still coming back in my hand. <laughs> you made it worse. It's conspicuous. I'm also going to troll you this. Conspicious. Ah, conspicuous. Conspicuous. No. So I get to search my library for a land? Correct. A basic land. I don't think there's going to be one. All right. You have a, a Savannah. I'm going to go to my end step and pass the turn. I think in your end step, I'm going to... Play Necromancy as a uh, instant targeting Avenger of Zendikar. I will bounce it to your hand. Okay. It has been bounced. And I draw off the Monarch now. Yes. yes. Yeah. yeah. We, did, we got that. Right. Oh my god. Draw. And these are Soulbound. Definitely Soulbound goes onto the stack. Right. I'm going to sack two to kill Vencer, of Kay. course. Yeah. That matters a only, yeah. only all of them out. Yeah, which is playing with fire. Draw, seven like. draw two. God, Moth is so I've already, good. I've already drawn for turn though. Yes, you're not. What's you're, not there? you're not really giving him much of a choice. <laughs> the, <laughs> Tim was like, "I'm gonna win, or you, you stack your creatures." Yeah, that's not. Well, they're they're always bonded. You know, or when I, I if I blink it once, then it's unbonded. So my field of the dead. That theater zombie is persistent. I'm gonna tr try to cast a survival fittest. It's a good spell. Great spell, even. I'm not going to respond. Yep. I'm going to try to cast a Crater of Beam. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. I see it. I see it, and I don't hate it. I'm going to sacrifice this Crater of Beam to Yawgmoth. 
All right. Um, six. Well, I got one, two, eight, nine. So they're six. all pumped by nine. Pumped nine. Yeah. You're gonna pay life to draw a card. Can we yeah, skip this one up. Does anyone have anything? Put a Busy. counter has on. To have As Reed Dubit yes. used to say, make him have it. Um, then I'm gonna necromancy the behemoth. The behemoth. Okay. Get another plus nine. I like plus this nine. move. It's a lot of damage. It's a lot of damage. Phil Swift would say. Um, oh, Beasy's got the various protection. Many, many minutes later. Before you go to combat, let me know, all right? Okay, I'm, I'm, I want to go to combat. Okay, I'm going to tap Greater Hoof Behemoth. Yawgmoth is the next biggest. And your Yawgmoth. not the biggest. You want to tap these two. The Hoof's actually not as big as the other ones. Oh, because the other ones have two triggers. There's two. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll yeah. tap one of your plants. All right. Now you really have to think. I do. But you should really send it all to Beasy because I don't think he has the fairies <laughs> protection. <laughs> How great would that be? Like, yep. He doesn't have it. And then it's like, why didn't you just win? He just precariously left three mana up because he has all four and mana spells. And holding up creatures that control get plus one, plus up. Oh, yeah. It's on board. So these are plus 18. That's 10. Just get them out. Let's duke it out ourselves. That doesn't Even make if any you don't sense. don't kill them, you're still in the same amount of danger by not killing me. So you have to make me have it, basically. And that's a, that's a five, five. My but all of Tim's can vote. If, if I just come with this mine, at you tramples over. So this, I don't, this I don't is know if he's playing solitude. Coming at Tim. I don't know if he's playing solitude. Well, if he does, he's got me. Oh <laughs> man, that's a piece. I actually do play solitude. Please, <laughs> bang. How much toughness do you have? You've had a lot of toughness. One, two, four, eight, nine, ten, eleven. <laughs> 12 plus uh, I can make an extra 2. So I have 13 toughness. 13? Well, kind of. 12 plus toughness. an extra 2. Extra of oh. I have a lot. So I gotta come at you with 22. I think we're in Make Me Habitsville. Yeah, I'm definitely in Make You Habitsville. So get him with everything. But I need to keep back as many blockers as possible if he does that. that that's it. fair. Um, that's why I have to tank so hard on so this. So just don't attack me? We're fine. <laughs> yeah. There's no one else. Um, <laughs> So that would be enough if I send two there, two there, and this here, right? So, well, so I do, it. in fact, have a spell to cast. It's the Fairy's Protection. Yeah. I'd like to phase out. <clears throat> All right, so go. So bad. let's move through combat slowly here. <laughs> <laughs> Save for your last moments. Uh, I'll activate Kiki Jiki mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. make it one and sticky, and I'll die. All right. Jerry's got last place. Confirmed. Jerry's died first. <laughs> Confirmed. Uh, we died during the same combat. Jerry's died first. He scooped up first. All right, so now the wiki becomes a monarch, right? That's how that works. Oh. He's the active player. All right, I guess um, I'm done after that. Let's see. Okay. Uh, what, that, what's going on with the mountain? <laughs> this snoop was terrible. All right, so you have two blockers, and I'm going to draw a card. I have two blockers. That's pretty much all I got. There's a lot of interesting things that can happen here. So definitely the, one of the last turns, if not the last turn of the game. Hated you. Yeah, all right. I'm going to play, I really don't, I don't have it in, on me, so I'm going to play Valkyrie Awakening, and I'm going to tuck all these cards. Yeah. Draw three fresh ones. This is the right way to tap out. I don't have the Sea of Clouds. This is not a play. That is relevant. All right. One, two, three. <laughs> what? What's so funny? The card I drew. That does not work the way... This does not work, right? Doesn't work. Does not work. How about that? How about that, folks? Oh, I'm not the mother. Which does relevant. do two damage. Yeah, that's quite relevant, actually. Okay. Like redraw with silent clearing. I almost blew that up with Thrasodon. <laughs> well. I was like, I didn't want him to redraw yeah, later in the game. Yeah, my cards I have to redraw with silent clearing. So mm -hmm. we're looking for juice, folks. We are looking for juice only. Is that juice? Uh, all lands are swamps. Okay. Forest swamps. Let me tell you that right now. Forests and swamps. Noted. And you have two blockers. You have two blockers. Oh, man. And I have three... I can only get through three damage. You're right. That's, that's true. <laughs> Let's not pretend like... I got a young Well... You have to pay yeah, life so for I that. get through one. So I guess if I attack you, I can get through one damage. Man, I'm so getting hoofed like a million times <laughs> next turn. Ugh. What instant speed ways do I have to make doofuses? I need to make two creatures at instant speed or find a way to just deal four damage to you. I think, you know, I don't think this is a bad shot. I'm going to play a Necropotence and basically oh, have geez. to kill you on my end step, I think. Um, I'm going to go to combat and I'm going to attack you for one, one, and three. One, one. And this one's gonna block 
Marchesa. All right. And then I'm going to... Pay life to take out this guy? I think so. So it's the same thing, right? And right, but I lose a creature and you draw a card. Yeah, okay. I don't think there are any... I mean, uh, how much life am I going to pay? All of it? Is there anything that's like, pay a life, make a dude? I don't think so. I'm going to pay 21 life. Whoa. I need to make dude. Guys, I need to make something like, happen here. Do you have like lightning bolt in your deck or anything? Like... 21. I'm going to slow roll the heck out of this. Oh, come on. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking, and I'm looking. Alright, that's a dead. <laughs> that's a super dead. Oh man. Well, I'm not going out without a fight. I am going to Colgan's command and say, deal two to you. Colgan's command gets you so close. I know, I'm gonna deal yeah. two to you I, and I think two. Oh, get back my Ophiomancer. That's uh, that's unfortunate, but I will extend the hand to you, sir. Oh, super dead. <laughs> oh man, we almost had it. All right, so three episodes deep, and the nerds still have won zero games. It was a super fun game, though, and uh, BZ, how did it feel to get so close? Someone let me know if I missed the damage. Please, on the last two turns, I just have to know if I missed it. That'll make me feel better. I don't think I did. Yep, uh, GG's. GG's. Close games. Close games. GGs. 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 Sorry, Mikey, we're not shaking. Yeah. That was uh, actually no. like a perfect square. <laughs> and then I get to say, uh, peace out, Trip Scouts. Well, no, to the big camera, to the good camera. Pe peace out, Trip. Right, we did it. They're peace. not joining us. We oh, did it. There we go. Thank you.